PJ Martinez and I serve as the Assistant Director for Retention and Diversity Initiatives with the Multicultural Center. Um, our goal is to lead them towards success while being a student and so during their time here my job is to meet with them regularly by either providing one-on-one -on -one meetings or providing them with programs to help them be successful um, while they're here. And these programs can range from academic programs to extracurricular social activities and programs that we do. And so throughout our time and throughout their time, we want to try to look at them at, at, from a holistic level, where we are looking at their financials, their academics, their social engagements, and everything that makes up a student. That's what we're looking at when I work with them. I'm at the perfect place working with the Multicultural Center. We have this motto that all are welcome in our space. And so we're working with students from all different backgrounds. And when you think of diversity, that's really what it is, is working with people from all different backgrounds. They don't have the same beliefs. It's just everyone coming together from all different beliefs. And I get the cool job of getting to hear what our students are going through, see and look into their experiences from high school, from their childhood, and see how they're doing at the University of Arkansas. And so I like to say that I have a pretty, pretty cool job in that I'm able to help them to see who they are as an individual and lead them to their time after school and help them with the resources to get them to where they want to be. What I think that we really do well in the Multicultural Center when it comes to increasing that knowledge of diversity and inclusion. Every first Friday of the month we do a program called First Friday and it's to increase the knowledge of different aspects of diversity, whether that be our Latinx, um, Latin History Month, or it be African American History Month, and just our different, our different groups and our alliance groups that we want them to be able to understand what it looks like to be part of that group and um, the history behind it. And so the programs that we put on are always, always there for a purpose. Now I know what we can do better is incorporating it from the whole university. So not letting it be just the Center for Multicultural and Diversity Education putting on these programs or the Office of Diversity and Inclusion, but other programs around the university coming together, collaborating, and, and creating that idea of what it looks like to be a diverse campus. And so every part of it, I think, that we work with should have some sort of incorporation of diversity and inclusion in the work that we do. So student success came about um, with the Chancellor's Guiding Principle in wanting to increase our um, underrepresented student population and so looking at students from the Delta region. Um, and this was a program that was created this past year under the direction of Trevor Francis and the Student Success Center. And the whole goal of that program in student success is to look at our student from a 360 approach, right? We want to look at those students who um, looking from where they came from in high school and providing them with opportunities such as financial aid knowledge, knowledge about wellness, knowledge about their academics. We want to look at them from all levels of who they are and try to lead them towards that success. So when you think of student success, it's not only looking at the academic piece, but looking at the holistic student and making sure that while they're here, they're being um, tended to in that way so they can be successful. The goal of it is to eventually open up a building that's going to allow them to allow it to be a one-stop shop where students can come in and all different parts of the university will, will tend to the students who need that help. And so you're going to be able to go into this big building that will then create opportunities such as um, the treasurer's office, advising, everything's going to be found in that area to increase the number of our students, making sure that they meet that four to five year requirement while they're here at the university and still giving that more of a spotlight approach to them, hands-on, holistic, 360 feel um, when you're working with them. A perfect program that we have in our office, and I think that actually tends to that idea of recruitment, is our college access initiative. And so that's sort of a little function of what we do with the Multicultural Center as a whole. So the role of the college access team is to go out to all the different areas in the state of Arkansas and talk about college readiness to all high, school, high schools in, in the state. And our goal is to promote 
college, not only the U of A, which of course we want to promote the U of A, but for just simply let our students know that there's college available for you and here are the steps that you need to get to college. And through that, we also have those connections with schools in the Delta region, with schools in the Harrison um, Northern region, Southwest Arkansas. We have all those connections. So that's how we get that recruitment piece to our students. You know, we can pitch the University of Arkansas, but our main goal is to let them know, here's education, here's what you can do after your time in high school. It may be a plus that you go to the University of Arkansas, but our main goal is to just show our underrepresented, under, our, um, our smaller minority groups that this is a university for you, and here's some, some tools that you can have to be successful while you're here. So the College Access Initiative is, I think, a great program for that. Our TRIO programs, and even admissions. I mean, looking at different schools that have that small population, that underrepresented population, I know they serve those as well. So I think we're doing a great job at it, and of course we can always do so much better, but um, for what we have now, I think it's a good number just to even look at. Definitely reach us at um, the Center for Multicultural and Diversity Education. Our email is uamc at uart.edu. Um, I always like to tell my parents that I work, the parents that I work with, that if we don't know the answers to the questions your students are asking us, we know people from all around the university that can assist you in that direction. And so whether it be a question in regards to business, I know people in the business school that I can reach out to that specifically work with diversity and inclusion. I also know people in admissions and in engineering. And so our goal is we want students, if you have questions for us, we'll answer them. But if we can't answer that, we know people who can do that as well. So Multicultural Center is a great place, um, uamc.uart.edu. And follow us on just on all of our social media as well.